Hello there, I'm George Dawn of Mentor Printers. We've been printing in Sheffield since 1956, and I like to think we're pretty good at what we do. But, don't just take my word for it, here's one of our customers to tell you her story. Hi, I'm Gertie Whitfield, and I work with Whitworks Adventures in Theatre, and we basically work with schools, um, bringing history to life, and recently we've been doing some heritage lottery funded projects um, all about World War One. And the one we've done here in Norbriggs has been nearly two years long. And it's consisted of getting working with the community, uh, working with the year fives as they were and now their year sixes, um, giving them research skills, doing research, and then that to kind of finish off the project, we, did, we produced two things. One was a Christmas um, play which told lots of the stories, um, and also a book. So the first book that we did in 2016 was with Mensa, um, and in particular, um, George. And the moment we saw the care and the product that we got, we had no doubt that we wanted to carry on working with Mensa, um, because there was clearly a passion and an interest. And, and the things that he did to the book, although we designed the contents of it, but the, the, how he twiddled it to make it look good. So for instance, um, things like, a lot of the pictures in it are old pictures. Um, so you've got old pictures there. And he would, he would always brighten them or he might place them somewhere better in the page than I could. Things like that. So you can see that originally that was on a piece of white paper, but what he's done is make it into um, a kind of like the beigey off colour so that it, it matches in and tones, so that the, the things become a, a piece in themselves. So you've got that. And, and those are things, because we do, although these are very simple books in some ways, they're just photographs and texts, it does matter to us um, what, they, what they actually look like. And although most of the pictures in this book are in black and white, even the modern ones, or sepia, the Turkish ones we have, have made in colour, and the reason being because actually we're talking about the beauty of the land and the light. Um, and again, that was something that George got really, really easily. And also, this storybook, which we're particularly proud of, George, what George has done is that, again, can you see how they match in with... So even though it doesn't look like the others and it's got a different thing, it's still got the, um, the map. Um, so that it matches in with the others. We've still got that beige colour. And then what, what he's done is he's taken the children's pictures and the, the colour here is um, to, to, to reflect a colour that's in the, in the picture. And, and then there's little things as well which he's done, which he, he and I started to twiddle with and then he did a bit more. But he's, the way he's divided up the text, so that too looks like something and um, actually has an impact on the story. Um, and look, there's another. I just, I, I was talking to George, and I said, I just want to do something a bit different. There he goes, how about that? So that, and that has great significance in the story, the way that that's laid out. Um, and again, they're simple little books, but I think they're really effective, and I'm very proud of them.